The second most frequent question I get when I'm wearing one of my kilts is, what clan is that? And I'd have to say that that question represents possibly the most common misconception about kilts and tartans in particular. And that's the belief that each design must represent a specific family name or clan. But you know, according to the Scottish Register of Tartans, there are over 7,000 unique designs, with another 150 approximately created and registered every year. There are corporate tartans, tartans for sports teams, for colleges, for branches of the military, policemen, firefighters, national tartans. The royal family has their own tartans. A lot of those tartans are restricted, and that means that they can only be worn by those in that particular group or organization. Then there are what are known as the fashion tartans, designs created simply for their aesthetic appeal. A tartan designer, and that's a real thing by the way, can select certain colors to represent a theme or a location. That designer can create a limited edition by specifying the amount of that particular design that can be produced. They can specify a mill to weave it and a clothier to offer it. And when it comes to the clan tartans, there are more today than there were years ago. And why? Not because there are more clans, but because there's a lot of experimentation with color palettes, creating weathered versions of a tartan or a muted version or what that tartan might have looked like had it been produced with natural as opposed to modern synthetic dyes. Today, you can even go online and create and register your own personal tartan. And if you'd like, you can have it woven by one of the Scottish mills. Though I have to tell you, it's not an inexpensive proposition. If you like a tartan, even if it's a clan tartan, and you're not affiliated with that particular clan, you can wear it, but it is proper tartan etiquette to be able to identify it if someone asks you. My name is Arid Matthew, Prescott, Arizona's one and only kilted real estate agent. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to tap that bell so you'll be notified when I upload new content. Thanks so much for watching. Cheers.